Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek, and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial. Not even a tutorial, to this fantastic video. In this video, we are going to explore one cool feature I discovered in Canva. So, if you are pumped up like I am to see what we can do, stay tuned and I will be right back after the intro. Alright, so here we are in Canva and before I even go into that, you can see I took out my um, drawing tablet also, which helps me to, you know, um, have a drawing feel when I feel like it. Okay, so um, there's something interesting I discovered in Canva. So in Canva, you can just open a blank canvas. Okay, so I just create a design and um, I just want a larger one. So before Canva loads up, here's what I have to say. Canva came up or not even came up Canva has always had this feature for you to be able to draw in Canva and if I say draw I mean literally draw and I'm just let's see okay so what you need to do is first of all just scroll down okay to more if you this is your first time discovering it then you can just search for draw or you should find a draw it's in beta mode okay so when you click on draw this is the cool thing you can see it gives you so many pen uh, marker glue pen highlighter whatever you want and you can i'll just choose pen okay so you can see this is what i have so in this case it means that you can literally draw anything at all you want in canva so with me that's why i took out my drawing tablet i rarely use this because i do less of that and when i saw this feature i was like hmm this is something very interesting which we can now do in Canva because now we can take things to the next level when it comes to this drawing um, feature. So I just want to test it out and um, let's see how things are going to work out if I'm to use my drawing tablet to make something, just a fancy um, drawing in Canva, okay? Okay, so first of all, I'm using my drawing tablet now and, you know, let's say i wanted to draw my name okay so uh, okay so okay so this is how it feels and you can see how it's looking the only thing is for the dimensions of the you know tablet it's a bit difficult to track because if you take the tablet you can see it's white so i usually take the whole screen but just with the canvas, it's like um, a quarter of the drawing tablet, which makes it uh, difficult. But if you have a drawing tablet, this is what you can do. There's a way out. Okay, so let me just switch quickly. Um, with mine, I just have to come over here and search for Huyan. So I can go into the settings, okay? And um, I can come to the work area. Okay, so in this case, you can see, you can adjust i don't want all display so you can literally adjust you know it to fit just the canvas on your screen so that's what it but it's a whole setting on its own but you know aside like i was saying let me just um let's say cancel oh okay so choose this and um, we are just going to increase it again let's this time around let's draw something so let's say i wanted to draw um a guy so I used to be good, you know, when it comes to drawing. Okay, so this is what we are doing, and I just, I just hope uh, what I'm doing <laughs> makes a lot of sense. Okay, so you know, guys with broad chest, yeah, and there's the arms. You understand? Just the only thing is with the pressure isn't really uh something that you can work you know in illustrator it works with the pressure and all of that from the tablet but with this nah the pressure ain't working okay so i just hope canva improves on that okay so this is just like with a six pack one two three four five six yeah so you can see what i have been able to draw so it means that if i reduce the size of it you know so you know this is how it's going to be like so it means that instead of like with the pressure coming from the tablet you either have to be adjusting the pressure okay so you know let's say this is the hair of the guy wow 
I think he's looking very handsome. You understand? So this is very interesting. Let me give him some beard, just like myself. And maybe he has some hairy chest, so I can just, you know, give some hairy stuff on his chest to make him look masculine in a little bit. And um, maybe some nipples. You understand? So you can see this is what the whole drawing thing is about. So in this case, if you are the type of person who loves to draw in Canva, then I believe this feature is a very cool feature to you. So let's try some of the other um, pen or markers or whatever. I don't know the name to give it, but let's try some of them and let's see how they are, okay, or how they work. Okay, so I'm back over here and I'll just choose the marker. And with the marker, okay, so marker is actually thick and you can also reduce the size, okay, so which is, you know, which is cool. With a glow pen, I'm sure this should be something that glows. Okay. So if we change the color to red, okay, let's see how it's going to look. Okay, so the glow is actually what has the color, not the exact um, marker or the exact thing, you know, because this portion is um, white and the glow actually is what takes the color. If it's highlighter, let's see. Okay, so highlighter is actually thick and it's also lighter. Okay, then we have the eraser which we can just use so normally i like to use big erasers you know so that i'm able to clean everything i am cleaning so that it's able to i don't even know what i'm saying you know, just pardon me if i'm making if i'm just uh speaking nonsense so you can see this how it is but i'm not saying because of this you should get yourself a tablet which you can you can get and i'll link i'll leave a link in the description box if you want to get one of these because um it's cool when it comes to drawing you know because instead of using the mouse which makes it difficult you can actually use this and it's a very cool thing to have if you want to move into the drawing space or you know now that canva has this feature i think this would be something cool you can have so yes this is what i wanted to show you in this particular video and i think it's an it's a very cool feature to have in canva because canva keeps improving so if you're looking for more detailed canva tutorials all you need to do is to hit on the subscribe button and hit on the bell icon you can also like this video to support the video and yes there are some interesting links i have down below if you want to have canva pro canva pro okay so you can check it out and yes you should get a very cool um price for your canva pro and yes that's all i have to say my name is benjamin i wish my mother is no limit to creativity i would see you in my next video